Hello YouTube, this is your boy Alex. Uh, we are definitely back at it with y'all know the 151 products. So I still have some along the way and I have some now. So I thought, come on, let's make a video. So today I will be opening this binder collection that they have out, which is pretty nice because gives you somewhere to store your cards in and uh you know I'll, i'm trying to complete this set i don't know if i'll be able to do it but this will be my first set to try to complete for uh pokemon uh, but before again we get ahead of ourselves if you do me the favor to like subscribe to the channel and uh, that would help you know the channel grow as it has been and thank you for the new subs i, I see y'all and uh, again, let's just get straight into the video. So we have this Pokemon binder, which looks pretty sick. And uh, it came in, I got this through, was it Best Buy? Yeah, it was Best Buy. And um, they're still missing a few things that I need to get as well from them. So let's open this up and uh, see what we think about this product. You know, uh, first of all, I know they have a God pack because apparently in Japan, they would be the only ones that would uh, receive that God pack. I'm trying to open this up. I'm trying to see from where would be the best way to open this thing, maybe from the side. <clears throat> but in Japan, they, uh, they have a God pack, and uh, which would be like ultra rares or whatever you want to call them, you know, all in one pack, so I'm hoping that we can do something similar, but in America, you don't get a full God Pack, you get a semi God Pack. So we're gonna we're gonna see what that's about. So here goes the four packs and the uh, binder. So let me get these packs out of here real quick. Let's see, so we got one, two, Three, come on, come on. Four, okay. <clears throat> so we have four packs of uh, 151. I'm excited. Uh, I was excited since I found out about this set uh, a long time ago. They were doing openings, uh, Japanese openings and stuff like that. Because, of course, they get it first and we get it second. But, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. Let's open this binder up. It feels good. The quality is not bad. It doesn't feel cheap. I'll, I'll say that much. Because usually sometimes the product that it comes with like the little freebies like this they'll be a little kind of like a knockoff you know sometimes but this actually feels good it feels like a real authentic binder look at that see so yep i'm uh definitely be putting my cards up in here so once i get the uh order like what's first second third fourth whatever so on then i'll do that but i think definitely it's enough room to fit the whole set so yeah it's just pages after pages so yeah so all right that's cool that looks nice definitely keeping this so <clears throat> let's see what we have um haven't forgotten i know it's still uh, a little early at least for me i just barely woke up a little while ago so i have a quick story i went to gamestop on friday and uh, that's when the set was released, which was Friday, the 22nd. And I had pre-ordered a uh, booster bundle, the six pack box. And uh, let me open and talk. So I had pre-ordered one and I got there <clears throat> to the uh, GameStop. So I was looking forward because I'm like, hey, I pre-ordered. I should be pretty lucky to get, you know, some product in and stuff like that. So I go and walk up to the counter and I tell the lady, hey, uh, excuse me. Uh, I'm here to pick up a pre-order and do y'all have any more 151 I would like to purchase and then she goes oh I think this is the last one so this has to be yours and I just told her like what like I can't believe y'all sold out like it just came out today and she goes yeah it's been she's like it's been hard to keep in stock because everybody wants to buy it <clears throat> and uh, I'm sorry I'm just drinking some coffee and uh so basically what I'm saying is that I got very, very lucky to be able 
to have gotten uh, an extra item from them because I pre-ordered one, the booster bundle, and then I was able to get an ETB from them, but they were pretty much sold out. A guy came in and he was all like, hey, do y'all have any more 151? And the lady told him, I'm sorry, but basically we're kind of like out. This is all we have left, which was the ETB box. And I think they only had two left. And uh, that's a nice Pikachu. And uh, they only, oh, don't tell me we already did it. Is this, is this the God Pack on the first try? Oh my God, if it is, come on, man. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> this is a very nice Squirtle, by the way. I thought this was it because the God Pack has the first three evolutions of the starter. So if it would have been a God Pack, it would have been Squirtle, War Turtle, and Blastoise, you know, in the back. But man, I thought that was it. Whew. That's that's a good looking Squirtle, though. That's uh, one of my favorite Pokemon. So let me uh, <clears throat> let me sleeve him up. So yeah, I've, I've uh, I was I felt pretty lucky that I was able to one reserve some you know product from Best Buy and get it even though I'm still missing like three was it three or four but three or four items from Best Buy so definitely I'm still missing some items from them so but then that's a sick looking squirrel I'm putting him in the back right here. let me just let me just toss him right here he, he looks nice he looks too nice so okay let's put this over here. <clears throat> I know this set a lot of people are chasing after it because it's so popular because of it's uh, the original 151 and uh, I love the art from this set um, they did a really good job on it and me personally I think that I think it's gonna hold its value so I know down the road if y'all want to keep some products sealed I would suggest to do so because I'm going to try to at least do that myself because I, I see it definitely going up in value. Like a good example would be the um, Sword and Shield, the uh, Eevee Evolutions one. What is it called again? Evolving Skies. Bam. I don't know why I had a brain fart. Evolving Skies. So I feel like this will be something similar for this new set, you know, because sword and shield that era is over with and now it's the new era which is what um scarlet and violet so i feel like this one <clears throat> i think is gonna be their number one product that they have so let's keep going so we got a mankey meowth execute my boy hitmochan that's one of my also one of my favorites um i prefer him over him only but yeah he, he's always been you know, pretty cool fighting type Pokemon. Butterfree, come on. Horsey. <clears throat> Magneton. I don't think we have anything on this pack. But they do have like one with a little Master Ball in the background. And uh, I think Pikachu is the one that you're trying to look for. That's your search. And they Kabutops and Energy. But um, I believe that's the one that everyone is trying to get in Master Ball form because it's worth a lot of money so so far i think we, we're doing good like it's not bad we have the kabutops hollow uh wheezing um what else um oh, and of course the, the squirtle so i like i like that one hopefully we get that blastoise because i think it's an homage to the original dark blastoise from team rocket so um he's doing the same little pose just in a different angle you can kind of tell uh, what else? What else? Oh, we got something good here. So, uh, Dratini, <clears throat> Growlithe, Geodude, Jigglypuff, Victory Veil, Big Air Balloon, Primeape, Primeape again. That's, he looks like the one from uh, Jungle, kind of. I don't know if y'all remember the artwork, but this looks very similar. Even the background has that same color green, so it's nice to pay attention to the little things. Mankey, okay. Almost star. Yeah, the, this is a really nice looking set and a electric energy. Yeah, this is definitely worth picking up. It just sucks that I have a feeling that oof, you are not gonna be able to find it uh, in stores because I think as soon as they put it out, um, you probably they'll probably just sell out immediately. So I I definitely see people overbuying this product like at store so 
Yeah. And I didn't even finish telling my GameStop story. So when the guy had came in behind me, the guy goes, man, I've been to Walmart. He said he went to three different Walmarts, two Best Buys and other GameStops and that they were sold out completely of the 151. So in my area, it's like slim out here where I'm at. So if you didn't uh, reserve or pre-order, I think you're going to be a, be out of luck because, yeah, yeah, it's not looking good for you right now. So that's why sometimes it's good to pre-order because you won't miss out. And even at that, sometimes you're not even guaranteed because Best Buy send me an email saying, oh, if we can get you your items by um a certain date that they'll just refund me my money back and i was like well there goes that so but luckily i I do have some more product on hand that i'll be doing some openings on but yeah look at this though this is nice though man <clears throat> do duo I, I like how they look a lot though this is vile bloom oh okay okay basic energy but looks sick but um Yes, so definitely I'm going to be doing more unboxings um, of this set. I have another one ready, but it's for another video. Let me get that for y'all. Give me a second. <clears throat> we have an ETB as well to crack open, but not in this video. That will be the next video, so stay tuned. Don't, don't worry, I'm going to open it. It's not going to stay closed. So we're gonna see what we get on uh, on that box right there. But I do have another little boxy booster bundle. This is the one I was able to secure. So I'm pretty excited for it. I got it and uh, let's just crack this thing open. Oh man, hopefully I should have done it from the bottom. Messed up the little box. Um, Yeah, I'm, I'm excited for this set. I, I can't say enough about it. it it's gonna be special i think the value of the set and the cards themselves are going to keep increasing as time goes by so i'll say five years from now ten years from now yeah this this set's going to be huge so i do see this set growing it's not going to slow down so if y'all definitely y'all definitely need to pick it up that's all i'm saying do not sleep on it just go ahead if you see it i would say buy it because you won't get another chance down the road watch this set's gonna end up increasing in crazy value um once everything is said and done so watch i'm telling y'all right now it's six more packs which is nice so <clears throat> i haven't forgotten um what else ah, i keep saying that oh here you go i might as well just bring it out so bye y'all okay mortal kombat one if uh, y'all want to throw down again let me know uh, i'll definitely you know uh, challenge some people if y'all want to throw down PS5 or anything because right now it's not cross play at the moment but it will be later down the road so yes Mortal Kombat I have it for PlayStation 5 just let me know if y'all want me to throw down with y'all a casual match competitive match I'm I'm fine either way it's all good to me um <clears throat> speaking of Mortal Kombat the graphics on it pretty impressive for next gen console uh, I spoke about the uh, Mortal Kombat 11, how that was one of my favorite games of all time. Um, I think this one's right up there as far as story mode. The gameplay, I don't know if it's just me, but sometimes I feel like it lags just a little bit when I'm trying to do certain combos. So I don't know if other people are experiencing that, but I know I am like, I need to, I maybe need, oh, that's sick. That's a good looking haunter. He's there creeping. It looks like he's in a house. Like there's like a little house and city right next to the house. Okay. Anyways, <clears throat> oh, it goes him only. Um, what was I saying? I already lost train of thought. Um. So yes, yeah, so like I was saying, um, Mortal Kombat the uh, one. Oh, that's a nice looking. Aerodactyl and uh, Matt Champ <clears throat> Mortal Kombat 1 I, like I said definitely do recommend it the story I'm like maybe halfway done I think I'm in chapter 5 and uh, it's good 
it really is good like i played all of them and the voice acting on the characters like johnny cage he's he's like a the comic relief you know for for mortal kombat and uh you know Liu kang is more on you know him being serious and stuff like that because he's a god and then raiden it's kind of like the roles reverse. So Raiden used to be a god, and now he's like Liu Kang in this era or this new world that Liu Kang built because he's the champion. So Raiden is the champion, Liu Kang is a god, and Kung Lao is still Kung Lao. So that that didn't change, which I thought I was like, okay, well, so much for being different. Anyways, <clears throat> the story right now where I'm at, it's it's good. It's very interesting. So if y'all haven't picked it up. I definitely recommend it. Uh, it's a good game. I'm still trying to get used to the combo system because I was so used to Mortal Kombat 11 and I used to play with Shang Tsung and they definitely changed him up a lot in this new game. So uh, will he be my main in MK1? I don't know just yet. So that's a nice looking water. I don't know just yet. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out who's going to be my main. I do like Raiden so far. I played him a little bit. And I like the way his combos are. I feel like they're pretty pretty fluent. And uh, I might try out Shao Kahn because he actually he, he he throws down with that axe, so he definitely does. He, he'll be whooping ass. So I'm gonna try to practice with Raiden, Shao Kahn, Reptile, and I'm gonna try again with Shang Tsung in this game. But I just he feels very different, and I think that's that's the thing that lets me down about. Shang Tsung in this game is that he uh, he plays very different so I'm not too excited about that that's the only crappy thing but yeah so again I'll, I'll keep you informed um, I haven't played too many online matches just yet um, but I will once I get a better hang of the game I haven't played it I played it some but I haven't played it all oh, that's nice I haven't played it enough yet Articuno, my, that's my favorite legendary bird right here. Out of the three originals, always the ice one. Oh, sick, we got it hollow. Okay, see, even better. Um, <clears throat> so yes, um, what was I saying? I keep just having brain farts today. I don't know what's going on. I need more, I need more caffeine in my system. Give me a sec. Mm-hmm. Okay, I think that's what it is. Um, so yeah, so that's basically MK mk talk for the day um i'll keep y'all posted on that as well uh the other thing football come on now football fans um again i'm from you know houston texas so uh we have the texans are struggling they're zero and two right now lost two games and uh same thing i love new england the new england patriots 0-2 as well. Terrible start for both of my teams. So hopefully they can get their stuff in order. They can get it together because, wow, like this is a whole new season. I expected a lot better from them. And right now they just need to they need a ball out. That's all they need to do. Stop worrying about the noise out there and just focus on the game. That's all they need to do. Focus on the game. Oh, that is uh, OK. I think this is one of the expensive cards of the set. Erica's Invitation. This is a very, very good card. You see that little double star in the bottom? 196 of 165. Um, they call them what, waifu cards or whatever? I think this is one of them, I think. I don't know, I, I have to check, but I know for sure this is a hard pull. That's, that's for sure, that's one thing I do know. So I'm, I'm glad I was able to get this one. That is very nice. Okay. Okay. Um, speaking of the set, they have like Alakazam, EX, and all these other cards uh, from it uh, that I would love to pull. So, But that was unexpected. I forgot all about that one. I knew she was in it because I've seen people open up the Japanese set, of course, like I said earlier. But I didn't know. Um, I mean, it, it didn't cross my mind that I would pull it. You know what I mean? Like, I wasn't even thinking about that one. I was thinking about the actual pokemon cards and not the trainer cards so man i'm i'm pretty glad that i was able to get that one uh, but yeah i know that one's worth worth uh worth some money so it's cool to pull one of the heavy hitter cards come on this pack does not want to open right here there you go 
<clears throat> but yeah, definitely stay tuned. I didn't mean to make this video a long video. Um, was trying to hurry up, but uh, I will be doing an unboxing of the ETB that I have, and uh, we'll see what we get from that one. So uh, excited to see what other stuff we can pull from it. But again, uh, I didn't mean to veer off from the NFL talk, but yeah, so those two teams, bad start, love both teams. Hopefully they can get a win today, Sunday, and uh, I can't remember who New England plays today, but I know the Texans play a divisional game, the Jaguars, so hopefully they can get that win. They need it, they need it bad, that's all I'm going to say. I don't know what needs to happen, but they just need to win. That's all I know. I'll definitely be wearing my jersey though, Cadabra. Oh, look at that, beautiful. Okay, Parasite, nice. Starmy and Electrode, okay, fire, cool. And uh, we got one more pack, so yeah, and that's that's it for the NFL run out the moment. I know it's not much, but there's not much to talk about when the team is doing bad, you know, like. Uh, they need superstar receivers. They need they need somebody to just step up. That's what they really need. I know Houston to have that rookie, C.J. Stroud, and this will be his third game if he ends up playing. Because I know right now he had like a shoulder injury that he's trying to come from, uh, overcome. And we have uh, Will Anderson Jr. that we drafted up to pick up in the draft. And so far, like, and just kind of waiting to see them, you know, explode. Trying to like pop out and you know cause uh cause an impact but we'll, we will see we'll definitely see so <clears throat> oh that's nice little cubone he's probably somewhere in the valley that's what i'm assuming oh my goodness what <laughs> erica's invitation again but the other version and they sit gyarados that's nice. No way. Two Erica's in one box. I know I'm, I was looking for the God Pack, but man, you can't beat that. I'm, um, that's crazy. I know people who don't really play Pokemon don't won't understand, but yes, the this, this Erica card is definitely valuable. I just can't believe that we got those two uh, off a little off a mini box. That's crazy. Man, that <coughs> my man, we're coughing up a lung. A little sick squirtle, but wow, that's all I'm gonna say is wow. Damn. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. That's 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 crazy. That's some crazy luck. All right. Well, again, I don't mean to make this video any longer than what it is. Thank you again for. Uh, for the support thank you for watching and like i said stay tuned for the other unboxing of the 151 that's next video coming up and uh, hopefully y'all like it and we have plenty to talk about and uh yes yeah, like always on to the next one thank y'all for the support don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe on y'all's ways out thank you again for watching the video it means so much to me Y'all have a good day. Peace.